Hi guys, Rachel Bop here. Yes, it's me, the voice behind all these little snippets. So we've got four more to go, including this one, and the next four, including this one, are going to be kind of gameplay with me talking over. Some of it is the things that you've seen before in the snippets, and the rest is everything that was in between those snippets, and there was quite a few interesting bits in between. So, but weren't really appropriate for separate snippets. So I just want to go through, and also I've learned a lot from posting the snippets because you guys comment with what you see and what you've learned, and there were things that I hadn't even seen. So I'm so glad that you saw them and mentioned them. Like, for instance, the curtains are moving in this scene ever so slightly, but like you see, I mean, look at them, they're flowing, it's so cool. So having putting these snippets up allows me to get the information from you guys and it's just, I just find it really exciting doing it that way. So if you're not enjoying the snippets or you haven't, like just watch the playlist at the end and then you don't have to watch each one every hour, that's fine. Probably should have told you that to start with, but never mind. So at this point, most of the household are asleep and uh, Cassandra is on the toilet. Uh, she really needed to go and someone mentioned that her hunger dropped while she was on the toilet again another thing I didn't specifically notice but yes it did she probably had a plop she's going downstairs now I also noticed that their loo handle is on the opposite side to what ours is at home perhaps that's an American thing I have no idea like their steering wheels are on the wrong side anyway so she's cooking now uh, the animations are what make this so smooth and amazing. I don't like the way things just disappear, but I think it is a good improvement on what we've had in The Sims 3, and that is the main thing. We need it to be a step up. So <laughs> the pan appears, and I think that bit looks really real, apart from when she starts going mental. We haven't seen much of the higher levels of cooking and things because obviously like everyone who's played it at these preview events like I did, we've just like started on it and had like a couple of hours so it doesn't really allow you to get that deep into the game. So it'd be interesting to see how amazing she cooks at level 10 or whatever. So she's happy now, you get that little bit of music every time their emotion changes. Also, if you have a mood mouse, uh, like the Steel Series one, it will change the colour according to that emotion. So there's a lot more colours um, of the plum bobs and emotions than there were previously. The I love I love it when it goes purple when they're asleep. I think that's so cool. Anyway, so she is eating her food. These are her aspirations that are over her head, and you can click them and turn them off. So I think I saw there that she wanted to buy a musical instrument. That was one that kind of popped up a few times with a few different sims. You can also change the colour down the left hand bar and you can just drag those in. I accidentally, and I left this in on the video, on the snippet, but I accidentally picked up that window um, when I was trying to click off. But So I left that in so I could show you how you just cancel it because a lot of it, because it's new, you kind of think, oh no, like, what? it's so hard, but actually if you just sit and, like, think about it, it's not that hard. Anyway, I'm going to go because I'm talking over my end screen now, so thanks for watching, see you in the next video. Bye!